Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel, Kate May Modern Day Mystic. We are looking at November's vibes for Sagittarius. Okay, November's vibes, Sagittarius. Chariot, my favourite card. You are overcoming obstacles, you are beating things, you are winning things, you are starting to get your focus back. Now, you might have been distracted recently or you could have, have you may still have some distractions around you right now but this card is really important about overcoming challenges and staying focused now if you'll notice he hasn't got any rain so he's not having to beat the living daylights out of these animals these sphinxes here he's in control and that's what it's asking you to be this month Sagittarius in control without having to crack the whip just keep doing things the way that you want to do them but stay focused. Don't be distracted by any drama rama or any shiny things. Keep with your goal, okay? This card is a card of travel, so it suits really well with you, Saji's energy. It's a card of coming home for me, coming home with good results, coming home successful, coming home in a good position where you feel like you've achieved things, you've overcome things, and you're winning. Okay, what needs your attention this month, Sagittarians? What needs your attention this month? your work particularly, anything that you want action in, maybe someone you know. So you could find that it's a fellow Sagittarian, perhaps a Leo or an Aries may come in around you that need a bit of attention. Could be somebody who is very strong, very determined, fun, very driven. They might need your attention. But it also, because this is a court card, so it could be either either, could also be the energy where you need to start taking charge a bit more, being a bit more authoritative and perhaps also a bit lightening up a little bit, having a bit more fun in an authoritative way. No one's going to push you anywhere you don't want to go there, but it's all about enjoying things as well. So focus on transforming yourself from not just hard working, but a bit fun hard working, but also getting on track of where you want to be. You're leading the way with this card. You know what you want to do. You know where you want to go and you're OK to start doing it. The focus is on building leadership now, ruling the waves, leading the way and taking charge, being authoritative, but in a in a kind of excitement way there. Someone excited feels like they're going to come in around you. So uh, it might shift your focus a little bit. OK, um, let's have a look at how you can make things healthy for this month there. So don't take on too much responsibility, Sagis. You know, you might be um, people who are thinking that you can just, you can, it's only down to you. No one else is going to help. If you want a job done, do it yourself and all that. But Sagis, this card says, like, try not to take on all that burden because it's not going to do your health any good. If you want to um, improve your health, you've got to put some things down or be mindful that you don't take on any more. Ask for help, ask for support, delegate. You don't have to do everything, carry everything. How can you improve your finances this month, Sagittarius? Okay, deep thinking. Virgo, hermit, deep thinking. Improve your finances by going back a step. Thinking about all your hopes and dreams, things you've put in a little box. What is it now that you really want to do? How can you improve things? Maybe you've um, been stuck for a little while. Maybe things have been a bit dark for a little while. The light is now coming around your finances, Sagittarius. So take a step back, reevaluate things, go within, and that's going to give you the answers of how you can improve things. Meditation always works for me with that okay so let's have a look at what you want to manifest action to manifest oh it is your finances but also this card um queen of pentacles is capricorn says so it's someone who can manage everything i can do this i can do that and run the horse and run the house and i can do this you can manifest where you can get on top of everything where you can be literally queen bee where you can feel more organized more structured more in control everything on material level but also on a nurturing level so your home your family your friends businesses, everything here. You can manifest that manifesting energy. Sagis is coming in for you to say, you've got this and there is success and you can master this. If you want to book a reading, contact me on katemay.co.uk.